we might want to change this boss trigger right grab this boss trigger here and if I go there we got end overlap sets the boss tri target and now if for example I want him not to come back like he's, he's gonna stay in that arena in that place and I don't want him to come back and go to my box volume again what I can do is I can duplicate my box here so if I go into my viewport and I select my box I'll say blocking blocking box now I'm gonna move this box back a little bit the reason why I'm doing that is because this is gonna be a blocking volume so I don't want to be uh, the user to touch that box and then be blocked and not be able to to enter right I want the user when he crosses that box the, the box the boss trigger the blocking volume is behind him so just to avoid that he touches that box with the hand and then he can't go in right so when he gets there this is the blocking volume this is gonna block him okay so I, I can do this a bit smaller as well don't need to be that big I can come here to my collision presets and I can select block all dynamics and that's gonna block everything including my pawn now on the event begin play of this box what I'll do is I'll grab my box my blocking volume and I'll set collision enabled to no collision so when it spawns in the world it will have no collision right and if I just control W to duplicate this node and I bring it down here okay so here when the player goes through my target through my uh, box there I turn the collision on and all I want is just uh, collision so query only no physics collision I think yeah that should work so save compile and now if I play I go through my box I start identifying my enemy but I can't come back it won't let me I'm stuck I got a fight nowhere else to go okay